Hey, I have been watching you from behind. How did you create entire report under five minutes? Simple. Because I've been using the latest AI features of Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Word, and Microsoft PowerPoint, I'm able to do all of this work just under five minutes. Can you please teach me the same? Absolutely, I can. Excel sheets. Two Excel sheet has different data. Okay, and we are going to add Excel sheet data one and Excel sheet data two. And we are going to combine those summed up data into a new Excel sheet. We are going to perform all these operations with the help of ChatGPT. Okay, guys. So now let's uh, go into the work. Okay. So here, this is our ChatGPT. So before, and I will be showing what are the files that we are going to add. We are going to use Google Colab and Python for this operation. This is my directory, okay? So this is the directory. I have this two sheets, okay? Uh, because we need to add uh, the sheet one data and the sheet B data. And then we are going to add it to your new sheet, okay? So it has number one column. It has 100 value and 200, okay? This is the first sheet. And the next sheet we have, this column will be num2 and the values are 200 and 500, okay? So we are going to add these two sheets and we are going to make a resultant worksheet. So let's see how ChatGPT is helping us to give the code, okay? I am closing this uh, sheets because it will create a issue if I am adding, if I am opening and if I am executing, okay? So I am attaching the sheets, okay? Yeah, sheet 1A. Okay, and sheet 1B. Okay, now the sheets have been attached. Now we need to enter the prompt. Okay, so now let's enter. Okay, so the framing of the prompt is important. Okay, so I am adding add entire column num1 because it was there anyway i'll open it before execution i'll close it okay num1 and this is num2 right num1 of sheet it's better we keep the sheet one underscore a dot xlsx and entire column okay entire column num two of this right because we need now num two of okay num two it has five two hundred and five 500. Num2 of sheet 2, right? Sheet 1, sorry. Sheet 1, because I'm getting yeah, sheet 1 underscore b dot So we are making such that it should add it in a column wise, okay? So we are making such that this 200 plus 100, it should give me 300. And this uh, like uh, this is 200 plus 500, it should give 700. Okay. So we need that format. Okay. So I need to make it because it should not calculate in row wise. Okay. We are ca calculating or we are adding it in column wise. both sheets in column wise and update the result okay and to into a new sheet new sheet
okay this is the part since i need to close it else while operation it may create some issues okay so this is the google collab as i said this will be the uh, location now i am executing it okay let's see how it is giving the prompt follow the steps it is giving load the data from both the excel files extract the num1 column and num2 column it's giving the extraction okay in case if you want to uh, prepare documentation you can add these parts okay because if you are a developer definitely there will be a chance you need to prepare documentation also okay so really i am i think you are liking this uh, video and the operation so if you like it click the link in the below description guys okay and join our workshop at a minimal price from the link given in the below description okay because definitely this workshop and the AI tools which you are going to work will definitely increase your productivity it will enhance your creativity and it's a powerful learning tool okay and it helps to communicate more effectively and also it will definitely help you long run in your career okay so don't miss it okay now we have got this code so now i will say that would you like to suggest a name for the new excel or should i choose a default time I am giving choose uh, some report name. Okay, I am making it as a report because I am. It is just uh, adding the part. Let's go one by one. Okay, so it has used the import pandas. Okay, and it has given. So okay, so I am copying the code. I am going over here, and uh, like I am executing because before that I should because here it has given the another uh, directory name our directory is here then only i can see the files okay so i am copying it here right and here same thing for here also because it is two files okay so now i am executing let's see yeah it has displayed whatever was present in the first sheet and the second sheet it has displayed okay so the next part will be okay it has come now we'll proceed to perform column wise addition okay that's the thing it is doing column wise addition let's see i'm copying the code okay so going here so it is doing the operation okay with uh, the tags over here if you want to know more about this code copy this code paste it in the chat gpt ask explain this code what it is doing definitely it will help you it, it will act like a tutor okay so let's see so guys whatever we said is correct right uh anyway i will uh, open after uh, this thing has come okay so 300 700 uh that means the sum of the values it has given okay see 100 plus 200 column wise right 300 200 plus 500 700 since i asked column wise if i would have asked row wise the operation would be different okay so that's what before i have given the uh, the prompt to chat gpt that i want want column wise okay so that operation is over now let's see so it is asking um now the column wise operation is over the result of the first rows are displayed now i'll save the excel sheet would you like to suggest a name yes i'll give uh save the uh, uh file name as report dot okay otherwise it will give some default name let's give our our name it will do so you can download this file okay that also you can see so that it will be it will appear in your desktop or where your default saving mode is there okay so i am copying the code going over here okay and again i need to give this path otherwise it will not be present in the record location where we are searching for yeah i am just to make a report one okay just for a understanding purpose okay and i am saving here save the file yeah it has done now let's go and see I refresh the thing once we can refresh yes we got report one okay so guys i'm saying 200 500 okay 100 200 
Okay. So 200, and so I'm um, let's see the third part. This is the new report it has been generated. So 300 and 700. 200 plus 100, that is 300. 200 plus 500, that is 700. That's what I made column wise. Okay. So imagine guys how easy this is, right? So I hope you enjoyed it because if you would have coded on your own, definitely it would have took more time. Okay. Because in simple steps, we have finished this thing. That is the advantage of chat GPT. Okay. Again, I'm requesting you join the workshop at the below link. Okay. And see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.